hello students welcome to my youtube channel so what is insurance in usa let's see its introduction what is insurance in usa insurance in the united states refers to the market for risk in the united states the world's largest insurance market by premium volume according to swiss re of the dollar 6.861 trillion of global direct premiums written worldwide in 2021 2.719 dollar trillion 39.6% were written in the united states so health insurance coverage of the total population so 49.6% employers then 5.9% non group 19.8% medicate 14.2% medicare 1.4% military and 9.1% uninsured person so his what is the history of this insurance the first insurance company in the united states underwrote fire insurance and was formed in charleston south carolina in 1735 in 1752 benjamin franklin helped form a mutual insurance company called philadelphia contribution ship which is the nation's oldest insurance carrier still in operation the first stock insurance company the first stock insurance company formed in united states was the insurance company of north america in 1792 from an industry dominated by a small local single line mutual companies and member societies the business of insurance has grown increasingly towards the multi line multi state and even multinational insurance conglomerates and holding companies so what is the regulation of this insurance state based in state based insurance regulatory system under the state based insurance regulatory system each state operates independently to regulate their own insurance markets typically through a state department of insurance or division of insurance the state regulatory system has been described as cumbersome redundant confusing and costly the naic act as a forum for the creation of model laws and regulation each state decides whether to pass each naic model law or regulation and each state may make changes in the enactment process but the models are widely albeit somewhat irregularly irregularly adopted then federal regulation of insurance the idea of an operational federal character was first raised after a spate of solvency and capacity issues plagued property and casualty insurers in the 1970s in 1979 and the early 1980s the federal trade commission attempted to regulate the insurance industry but the senate commerce committee voted unanimously to prohibit the ftc's effort the dot frank act also establishes the financial stability oversight council that is fsoc which is charged with monitoring the financial services market including the insurance industries to identify potential risk to the financial stability of the united states organizations admitted versus surplus an important artifact of the state based insurance regulation system in the united states is the dichotomy between admitted and surplus insurers to relieve insurers and brokers of the of the tedious and time consuming chores many states now maintain export list of the risk that the state insurance com- commissioner has already identified as having no coverage available whatsoever from any admitted insurance in the state by their very nature export list illustrate what us insurers consider to be a hard to insure risk 
although surplus line insurers are still regulated by the state in which they are actually admitted the disadvantages of obtaining insurance from the surplus line insurers are that the policy will usually be written on a non standard form and if the insurer collapses its insured in states in which it is non admitted will not enjoy certain types of protection available to insured in the state in which the insurer is admitted however for person trying to obtain coverage for unusual risk the choice is usually between a surplus line insurers or no coverage at all so stay tuned for more videos thanks for watching bye bye